Today I'm going to show you how to search the CW Mars catalog to request books from the library. To start, I recommend going to the Chicopee Public Library website, chicopeepubliclibrary.org. From here, you can get to the catalog a few different ways. You can get to it from the main menu. You can also search the catalog directly from the home page, or you can select account and catalog from the help helpful links menu. This brings you to your library card account login. You can also feel free to bookmark this page so you can go directly there in the future. So you'll type in your library card number and your PIN number. If you don't know your PIN number, you can call the library and we will help you reset it. So I'm gonna type in my library card number and my PIN number and click login. Once I'm in my library card account, I can see what I have checked out on my card, what holds I have requested, if there is anything ready for pickup, and if I have any fines on my card. If I want to get started on my search, I can click in this box and just type in a keyword term search. There are options to narrow down your search by keyword, title, journal title, author, subject, and series. You can also narrow down your search by format. So if you're searching for a book or a movie, it's usually a good idea to narrow down by format. You can also narrow down by what library you would like to search. So you can search all of CW Mars, or you can just narrow it down to what we have at the Chickabee Library. So that depends on if you know what you're looking for and if you want it right away. So I usually start by narrowing it down to Chickabee Main Library. For this example, I'm going to do a keyword search for Louise Penny's book, Still Life. It's the first book in the Inspector Gamache series, which is pretty popular. So I'm going to just type in Louise Penny and Still Life and click search. So I get the results for the books that we have at the Chickabee Library. Um, this is the large print copy, and it looks like we, we own a copy, but it is currently checked out because it says zero one copy is available. We have the ebook version, and we have the e-audiobook version as well, but I would like the regular print format. So I'm going to go up to format and narrow it down to all books regular print, and I'm going to search all of CW Mars. So because this is a book that has many different editions, um, you'll have to look closely at what edition you want. So these are paperbacks, I see. Um, so I'm gonna keep going down. This says paperback. And then I think this looks like it is the hardcover edition. So I'm gonna click place hold to request this edition of the book, Still Life. Now I'm already, I already logged into my account at the beginning, so I'm logged in. All I have to do is select my pickup location. Right now, because we're doing curbside, we'll be calling everyone to let them know when their item becomes available. So I can just disregard these um, notification preferences at this point because we will not be emailing or texting. We, we will be calling. So I'm just going to select submit. And now this book is on hold for me. So to show you how to request multiple books at a time, I'm going to show you how to use your basket option. So let's say I want to request the second and third book in this series because it's a very popular series and I think I'm going to enjoy it. So I'm going to continue, which brings me back to the original search results. And I'm not sure of what the title of the second book in the series is. So I'm going to click on the first book. I'm going to scroll down and what's really useful in the catalog record is it shows the book series um, the order of all the books in the series. So I want to request the second and third book. So I'm going to click on the title of the second book. And because I want to read the first book first, I don't really care where it's coming from. I just know I want the the hard copy. So I see it's 
have some paperback, paperback, audiobook, and this is the hardcover. So I'm going to click Add to Basket. And then I'm going to click on the title to get back to the to all the books in the series. Scroll down and click on the third title. So I'm going to scroll down until I find the hardcover, which is here, and I'm going to click on Add to Basket. So now at the top, you can see you have two, I have two items in my basket. I'm going to click on Basket, and then I'm going to click on Actions for these items and Place Hold. Click Go. Pick up location is Chickabee Main Library. I'm going to disregard these options for now, and I'm just going to click Submit. So now all three items are on hold for me. I can see that when I go to my holds, I can see I have all three titles placed on hold for me. So as you can see, there are a lot of different ways that you can search and browse the CWR's catalog. If you're ever having trouble in your search, please don't hesitate to give us a call at the library, 594-1800 extension 3. We would be happy to walk you through your search over the phone or to place the holds on your card for you. Also, if you're looking for some book recommendations, we're now offering a recommended, a customized reading list where you can submit online through our website um, a personalized reading list request form. So basically you just fill in your reading preferences, what genres you like, what books you don't like, some of your favorite authors, and we put together a list of books that we think you would enjoy. When your items come in for you, as I mentioned earlier, the circulation department will give you a call to arrange a curbside pickup appointment. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to give us a call. I hope this has been helpful. Thanks for watching.